25 minutes to 12, just for comedy value. The um, uh, Those secretly funded people at the inst- so-called Institute of Economic Affairs, who, of course, were boasting not long ago about how they'd overtaken Downing Street and were entirely responsible for the economic policies of Kwasi Kwarteng and Liz Truss, have inevitably, but somewhat early, arrived at the, um, oh, no, they didn't do it right. No, real libertarianism was never actually tried. Um, I'm not sure where this interview comes from, but the uh, so I don't know what his name is. They've all got such amazing titles at the IEA. They're all called things like head of skateboards and roller and, and, and roller discos, or well, was one I saw the other day, head of lifestyle econo- head of lifestyle economics, head of education. I think everyone's head of something. I think that the people who answer the phones are head of switchboards, head of switchboard economics. So I can't remember what the bloke in charge is called. I think it's called. I think he's Lord High Panjandrum. Chap called Mark Littlewood, the Lord High Panjandrum of the secretly funded so-called Institute of Economic Affairs, is is saying that um, it, she got it the political execution wrong. So there's nothing wrong with the ideas that, of course, saw Liz Truss's premiership and Quasi Kwarteng's chancellorship break every record going for for their brevity. Nothing wrong with the ideas at all. It was the quote political execution end quotes, um, saying if the execution goes badly wrong, it has a rebound effect on the ideas. The position we're in now is that these reforms basically have not been tried. Her attempts to implement change were too hurried, too rushed, not thought through, naive in some regard, which of course they didn't say when they were doing a lap of honour about their responsibility for these ideas and their influence on the politician who sought to implement them. But hey-ho, don't try not to get cross with the, with the, with the messengers, because we, we don't know who's paid for the message. Um, that, that, that's always the point with these people. 